Is this one ready too? Go live! Hey! Two pillows is go live! Two pillows is go live! Four pillows is live! Ay, ay, ay! My tomato plants are out of its stone, baba. So cute. So I just took the um, domes off my tomato plant. As you can see, the top leaves are wet from reaching the top and me shaking off the water and whatnot. But look at them, they're so cute. Two weeks to really reach this. And now I gotta add nutrients. Cooking four cups of rice in this mini rice cooker and heating up my water for my lemon tea this morning. Right here. This one's really good actually. Good morning guys. So today we are gonna go to New York to celebrate Joshua and my two year anniversary. I'm just gonna get uh, some light makeup today because we are going to get a massage so we i don't want to ruin my eyebrows or anything like that so i might just lightly shade them in uh define them a little tweeze them a little and then um just some highlight and stuff but yeah more like natural look today and then i'll show you my outfit after sometimes i like to watch things while i do my makeup i plugged in the um little usb um port so it could light up because sometimes the window is not open and i can't see it as well so this actually gives me very good lighting mm -hmm. i'll drop the link to this product down below i really like it hello guys we are back home uh, i took a lot of photos and stuff if you follow me on instagram you've probably seen it on my story if not i'll put an array of photos right here on the screen So you can see what we did today. Pretty much uh, we just walked around, chilled, shop, ate some food. And I want to show you what I got today. So the first thing I bought, um, so I've been wanting a pair of boots, snow boots. I had one from uh, JCPenney that Joshua and I got in Minnesota, uh, 2017 I want to say. And uh, I really liked them. However, after I want to say maybe over a year or two. They definitely worn out, so I gifted them. Look, my mom wanted them, so I gave it to her. But I need a pair of good snow boots, sturdy, or just boots in general. Now, it just happened to work out that I got like really nice snow boots. So, this is the first time I ever bought from this brand. Joshua was the one that uh, was like, hey, let's go there. So then I was like, okay. So this is the brand RM Williams. And this is the packaging. That it comes in is a dark brown uh, box. It looks like chocolate, like a chocolate box. This is unisex, so uh, four and a half and unisex. So I'm seven and a half, uh, just like, you know, women's eyes. Saddle and leather dressing, so it preserves conditions and nourish all types of leather. So you just uh, use a knife to like kind of open this can and then you just can use your hands and just kind of like lather over the boots to make them like, you know, shiny and conditioned and new. This is what it looks like. It's black. You can't see it too well, but it is black and yeah. You'll probably see it in some videos or outfits on Instagram and stuff. But I really like them. They are pretty comfortable and I like the fact that at first I wasn't too like sure about these little tags right here, but it's really nice when you loop your fingers through and just pull them in and like put the shoes on. So I really like this one. It's really nice. It feels really, really nice. I always go for leather boots. I'm not a, like a huge suede person because it's just too much maintenance for me, you know? So that <laughs> costs a good amount of money. And this one, we just like, were walking down the street after the shoe purchase and we're like, what? Pokemon shirts? So we waited in line. They opened yesterday, so the line wasn't as long today, I would say. So we didn't wait way too long. Um, so they gave me this uh, Pokemon sticker magnet. So right here, we're gonna put it, put it on the fridge. Right here. <laughs> and then 
They also gave me a candy. Strawberry flavored one with Evie on there. Uh, we ate it. I split it in half with Joshua. And then this cute bag. And I don't know if you can see the Pokemon on here, but I'm gonna bring it a little closer. He's so cute, right? So this is really cute. They have one um, it with different Pokemons on there, but this one looks the cutest and you know, very nice color kind of thing. So this is the packaging for the shirt that I got. It was a pretty pricey shirt, but I was like, hey, like how often does this happen? And you like, you know, I'm really into Pokemon. I grew up on Pokemon. So I bought one and I was just like, you know what, let's do it. Uh, they say you could order online. I'll put the link down below so you guys can, you know, um, shop around and stuff. They, you, sh you could shop online, but I don't know if the colors look well on me, there were the patterns that I like in store. So I'd rather purchase something that I really, really know that looks good on me rather than something I just like and might not look good on me if I bought it online, if that makes sense. So nice. Ta-da! Can you guess what this Pokemon is? Well, you, I mean, you clearly see it, but... Isn't it so cute? And if you guys don't know what this Pokemon is, I'll show you. It has it on the bag it's a box i mean vial plume women's medium so this is medium it's really cute i like it a lot and if my hair is darker actually if my hair is black again it will match really well but either way this still matches uh has, has a very hawaiian feel this is hawaiian style so it's like a cut off tee but like smaller a little closer to like a um, tri like not tripod, um, a crop top a little bit, but it's like a dress shirt. <laughs> That's my Pokemon piggy bank kind of thing, uh, Pikachu bank. Um, yeah, that I just throw coins and stuff in there to save extra money. But yeah, this is my purchase today. I'm really happy about this one. This is like a bonus compared to the shoes and everything. Uh, and baby, come here, show them what you got with your shirt. Are you dancing in the corner? Come here. <laughs> And look at Joshua with his cute haircut. Seven hundred dollars. Not even. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So we're just uh, chilling right now. We just got home, um, and then we're gonna order from this food truck outside of our studio, or not outside, right outside our studio, but outside of our apartment complex. So it's really nice. Today was to celebrate our two-year anniversary. Our anniversary is on the third of October, but you know we decided to do it on a weekend because you know we are working adults now. So yeah, I'll show you the food later. But let me know, would you guys get this? Um, go on their site, maybe uh, see what pattern you would get or anything, or screenshot the photos that uh, I showed you earlier and just tell me which one you would uh, like go for or what's your favorite Pokemon. Because they, I think the original 151 uh, Pokemon uh, characters were like, you know, on a pattern for sure. So which Pokemon is your favorite from the originals? Let me know down below in the comments. Joshua got us these two entrees. I got the fish, aka tilapia, chicken, uh, white sauce, everything, veggies, and rice. And then Joshua got the lamb and chicken, same thing, veggies, and rice. And it's super good. I don't know if you guys ever try halal, guys. Pretty good, actually. Just not as um, big. It's a little smaller than the container that they give us, but it's still pretty good. We finished eating and I'm just gonna take a shower and that's gonna be pretty much it. I'll see you in the next clip. So I finished meal prepping my orange chicken, the healthy lean version with some broccoli and some other veggies. And this is Joshua's portion. I switched him over to this as well because the ground turkey just wasn't working out. And I feel like he's been pretty bored with that. And I don't really know how to season ground turkey well unless it's like I make it with pasta or some other stuff. But if you just tell me to make ground turkey, I don't know how to season that for some reason. I'm sure I could find some recipes, but this works better and it's more delicious. Tofu and there's a drumstick underneath with some rice, curry, and then Joshua has all the uh, drumsticks because his protein source is like that. 21 days planted and here's the status. This one is flourishing a lot more. As you can tell in the bottom of that, there's a baby little one over there. That one stopped growing after like the first two, three days once it sprouted. 
so there's only one main stem which I prefer I wish there wasn't so much to deal with right here but you know once it gets a little taller I'll prune them and then I just put uh, this fresh new thing of scallion in I cut it off at the tip right here and as you can see it's already growing it's only been nine hours since I planted it so that's kind of crazy how fast it grows so I'm gonna end the vlog here thank you guys so much for watching this Sunday chill day two-year anniversary celebration um, meal prep chores all this stuff um and if you guys didn't get a good look at the magnet earlier this is what it looks like and if you guys want to know the recipe for the orange chicken i have it right here take a screenshot of this yes we do got another magnet as well but take a screenshot of this pause this video and screenshot it very easy to make actually and I'll probably link the recipe video down uh, down in the description box but yeah that's pretty much it so thank you guys for watching so much love you stay strong my dumplings I'll see you next time bye, -bye.